whether there are indications that by a completed cross examination, the testimony was likely to be seriously shaken, prevented. Death or illness before cross examination makes the evidence in chief admissible, though its weight may be slight. But absence from the country or temporary illness has been found to be insufficient, a proper cause being to adjourn the trial or issue a commission. And reject the, the court rejected the evidence of a witness who fainted and was unable to be cross examination. Under the circumstances, the court finds that the evidence produced by PW4 shall remain on record and will not be expunged. However, the weight to afford to PW4's evidence will be less than which would have been given to her evidence in the event that it had been tested through cross-examination. The court appreciates the efforts of both the defense and the prosecution counsels in this manner. Their submissions were thorough, guiding, and well presented. Therefore, we will not expand the evidence of PW4 from the record. Thank you, Your Honor. The most of Raghi. And uh, Your Honor, since I had the, uh, in terms of the, where this issue arose, for purposes of lodging the appeal, we know the process it will take. And we also uh, thank the court for purposes of the, uh, the rendering the, charge, the ruling, which I think will shape the criminal justice system. As, as you have participated here, Your Honor, it, it was so profound for us that the law was silent and we had to borrow from the. So we would uh, like to settle that issue with the higher court. And uh, if the court can give us the ruling, together with the the, the the proceedings, I know we are having uh, hearing dates uh, in two weeks' time. And uh, um, so, if we can be given uh, these proceedings earlier, we can be able to launch our appeal even before the, the hearing dates, and the court can give directions. The High Court can give directions on those issues. I add my voice to views expressed by my life friends and mine. Ruling and the relevant proceedings be availed to allow us to lodge an appeal against that ruling.